my scotch collection. Hi. Here we are. We got the net. Uh, we're just getting ready to go camping for Ryan's birthday and our friend's birthday. And I was hearing chirping and squeaking. And I'm like, is there a chipmunk in our house now? Our house is becoming a bit of a zoo. And if you saw a little while ago, I did a Facebook Live. I wrote a little bit about bats and how much they freak me out. And now I know that bat, the bat totem is actually an amazing thing. And I'm working on not being afraid. But it's um, all about letting part of you go that isn't serving you and letting that put part die. Down. Putting the net down. He's giving me scotch bottles right now <laughs> to put the net down and I, get I, rid I, of the bat. Scotch. I don't want my bat, the bat near my scotch. So the poor little bat was hiding in the scotch bottles. And um, he's in Ryan's glass that actually says canoe and Ryan was just out and I called him like I don't okay. know if I can do this myself so Watch the out. poor little bat is in this canoe glass the poor thing he's so scared so talk moving. about we're being scared oh there there's he is two of them. oh there's two of them in there two of them. I think they've had babies oh this is crazy anyway we're getting bats out they were squeaking away our kids need proof that we've actually got rid of the bats because look there they are they've been in our house in the canoe glass hanging out they're probably so scared <laughs> Oh, I'm scared, but talk about reliving and just getting rid of the old, uh, getting rid of the things that aren't serving us, and oh my gosh, it's totally a symbol. So if you're not sure what a bat totem is, you need to look that up, because that's clearly what I've been having to work through. Ryan is releasing the bats right now, and yeah, I'm not sure what we're going to do with them. Um, Harley's not happy in the background, um, but there's two of them in the glass right now. What are you going to do with them? Um, we, we can't. What do you do with them? I'm gonna throw them right there. Well then what? They might come back in. What do you want me to do? Drive them 60 kilometers away? <laughs> They'll fly back.